Hey guys, I am back for the last changing video. <clears throat> I have finally come to a name for this little guy after some digging around. Um, his, his former name used to be Spencer Andreas. Um, I used to have a Hispanic um, Real Care 2 boy <clears throat> that I first named Spencer Andreas. Um, but now obviously he is a neo weighted neonate and with the whole name changing thing um, I'm planning on keeping the boys at least their first name uh, at least their first name is going to be kind of like with their heritage. So like Yukito is uh, a Japanese male name I wanted a Hispanic male name for him. Skyler has been a pretty popular American name, at least in the early 2000s. Um, and I want to eventually get at least one of each race, like boy and girl. So the boys are going to, I'm going to try to keep to their heritage names and the girls just kind of have the fun names where it doesn't really matter um so anyways his new name i'm gonna leave the andreas because that is actually my godson's middle name so um and the middle name andreas for spencer came from my godson so his first name is going to be andreas which is alexander um, in Spanish. So he's going to be Andreas Jackson, or AJ for short. Ugh. I know it seems kind of odd having Jackson as a middle name for him. It's just Andreas Jackson seemed to flow together. I, mean, I was trying to think of another middle name, but... Everything else that I came up with didn't sound right to go with Andreas. Except for Jackson. At least in my mind, so. He will be Andreas Jackson. The other idea was Andreas Oliver. And yeah, that didn't really flow too well for me. Uh, but. So I am going to change them into this Ralph Lauren outfit I got at the thrift store when I went about a week or so ago. Um, I'm hoping to get back this week to see what they have. And um, that children's resale shop that I go to actually moved. So I need to find where their new location is at. Um, they moved a few weeks ago and with everything going on with end of school it got not being able to make it to their closing of their other store and the grand opening of the new store but I'd like to make it there um, just to check out to see what they have now I have some toys that I'm gonna try to take there as well I was just going to uh, kind of stock up on stuff for um, the consignment sale um, I'm going to go through clothes. I might see about selling some of them there if they'll buy them this time. Last time the issue I had is they went through everything and they didn't take much. So I felt it was a waste of time. I might try to give them one more chance and see how it goes. Um, but I don't know for the consignment sale. All of like the toys that I took there and the bigger items, only two of them I brought home everything else sold and so it seems like for the consignment sale yeah the clothes sell but there's so many clothes ex well except for my son sizes those I might keep out because it seemed weird because they didn't take any of those sizes when I took them over to the second hand the kids second hand store because I don't know they didn't have much in his size to begin with and then all of his stuff's in good condition and they didn't take any of it 
Um, so it just seems strange. That's why... I don't know, like, you go there and they're full of clothes. And... The consignment sale has a lot of clothes as well, but it seems like at the consignment sale, I can do better selling the other stuff, such as... Um... Like, a bunch of the toys. Or I might have a yard sale. I don't know. I haven't decided yet. But... Anyways, Andreas is in his outfit. Oh, we got to put his passy back in. This is a Ralph Lauren outfit, and I thought it might be way too big. It's it's big. I guess you guys can't see his legs. It's a little on the big side, but it's not overly huge. It looks comfortable. Anyways. But I just... Trying to... I came up with a few other names. If you follow um, my reality with Nicole on Facebook and you go into my photo albums, you'll probably see some of the girls' name changes too. Um, Trista, I actually ended up naming Ireland. I really like the name Ireland in, I don't know, Ireland, her middle name was Jade. So Ireland Jade just worked for me. I didn't really want to lose the Jade because I do like that middle name. So I changed her first name to Ireland. And then we've got Andreas Jackson now. And I need to find a new name for Tyler. So I'll probably be looking up, try to figure out baby names for that. I've also been kind of coming up with other baby names for babies I plan on getting in the future. Um, so I don't forget them because then I'll be the point I get the doll then I'll be like uh what was I gonna name it so in my um, external hard drive I'm already starting the albums for them but yeah like I said I I'm kind of renaming just due to the fact that I initially started out to do kind of like matchy matchy names like I had Tiffany Allison and um, I had another Trista, his middle name I believe started with an A, then I had, uh, not Trista, Tristan, then I had um, Trista Jade and Tyler Jane, and then like the boys I would have um, SN and then SA for their initials and I just decided you know what I'm done with kind of doing matchy matchy names I'd rather have names that don't start with the same letter and they don't really match although people that know my real kids names know that their names do match I, at one point though I did used to have um, my goal was to have 28 dolls or 26 dolls excuse me and the 20 I was going to do 26 dolls and each one started with a different letter, but I gave up on that. But anyways, I've been kind of rambling a little bit. Um, I hope you enjoy this video and I will see you all later. Bye.